Stephanie, fellow pioneers of human transportation. I'm Yogi Steve, and you're watching ESA, the Electric Scooter Academy videos about high-powered scooters. Thank you for joining me. Please like, subscribe, comment, set your notification for the live stream. I have an exciting new stream coming. I'm out here on the Roadrunner V2. Use my bonus code, Electric Scooter Academy, to get $50 off this scooter. Make sure you join the eMove Roadrunner Academy on Facebook. That's where you can learn everything about the Roadrunner line, both the V2, this model, the smaller one, and the bigger, faster one, the Pro. Guys, thank you for joining me. We got both batteries out here. We're gonna do a long shift. We're gonna to try to make 100 bucks in five hours or less. First order is a $7.50 Starbucks run. We're right here. Hey there, I got a Keeley with a K. Alrighty, thanks guys. See you next time. Oh my God, these are dangerous. We're gonna pack it nice and deliver it, team. Let's go, thank you. Pretty much know exactly where we're going, 1800 Vine. It says drop off in the lobby, but sometimes that means like in the lobby on the 10th floor for this fucking building. So we'll figure it out when we get there. Thanks for joining me again, guys. Let's make this 750 plus. I really love the Roadrunner V2. It came in perfect today because I have two scooters down. My frigging, oh yeah, there's the entrance. My GTR had a, has a flat. I don't know what I gotta do. Maybe I gotta add some bead sealant to it. And my RS just went like completely down. So I think what I'm gonna do to make this job like easier but harder is I'm just gonna carry my scooter up the stairs here. That way I don't have to lock it up. And this is pretty easy, pretty easy to do with this scooter. It's what I like about it. Even with the second battery, it's not that heavy. Maybe it's 50 pounds total. And I can just hide this up here. Nobody will fuck with it. How you doing? This is a DoorDash for Kaylee. It says leave in the lobby. Is that right here? Okay, great, thank you. Perfect. All right, let's see how much this one paid out. It could be a good one. Or maybe it's just 750, I forgot. 750, all right, that's fine. It's gonna be another beautiful day out here. Let's take Coenga back to Chick-fil-A. We got a $14.50, 1.3 mile coming in. How far into the hills is this though? It's just two Starbucks orders. Do I want to do this one? Oh man. No, I don't want to take the Roadrunner into the hills. That sucks. We got a great McDonald's order. $7.3, total will be higher. Fuck yeah. Let's go to Hollywood Boulevard. Is it Hollywood? Yeah, exactly. Let's go. Whoa, 12 items. This is a big ass order. Something I like about the Roadrunner is you can hold the center bar and pick it up and go down and up curbs very safely. You don't want to jump curbs on this thing, that's for sure. You want to treat it gently. It's a good road machine. It's not a good off road machine. But I've got, I don't know, I've got like 1,500 miles on this bitch. The scooter's holding up really nice. Let's see if we can make this move here. Yep. It's already closed. She closed it. Oh, it's dos? Okay. Thank you. Just put it right here for me. Thank you. Oh my God, this fucking place, the Coke machine was down and they let the food sit out there for 10 minutes waiting for me to tell them just put a goddamn Dr. Pepper in there or something. Motherfuckers, look how giant this is too. This better pay a lot. This is absolutely gigantic for a McDonald's order and we're going to Dave & Buster's which is on the third floor of the mall. It's not that hard to find. We got the secret elevator to the third floor. Let's go. Sort of a secret elevator, third floor. Let's go. Dave & Buster's. Never actually been to a Dave & Buster's. I know what it is though. It's like video games, food, and kids, right? Definitely not supposed to ride this in here. Oh, there's the Dave & Buster's. But uh, I don't see any security or nothing. Fuck them, fuck them. Hey guys. Yeah, for, for uh, Andy G. Oh, Andy Garcia? I guess so. <laughs> Thank okay. you. Thank you. Yep. I guess we're going with the Celsius today. My girlfriend saw that I drink these, so she bought me a bunch of them. I have a good girlfriend. Let's drink this medicine. Wake it up. I guess Starbucks is keeping us busy. 7.75. Total will be higher for 0.7. We like that. I don't even care if it's for a lot of drinks anymore. I'm immune. Five items, Jesus. Okay team, another big one. Hopefully it'll be another big payout. Let's go. We're going to so, some address on Sunset that I'm not familiar with, but it's like a meet at the door, so that's nice. Let's go. Okay, this is us right here. What did they tell me to do? Oh, I guess hit, hit the buzzer, I guess. Bye bro, thank you very much, enjoy. That's it. 
Oh, it's not a big payout, but eight and a quarter is still not too bad. Let's go back to the base. We got an unfortunate three and a quarter half mile Chick-fil-A, but we're doing it. Hey there, I heard you guys call Jen. How you doing, buddy? I got Jen H. Thank you. See you guys next time. Whoa, shit. <laughs> tried, to, tried to escape. I think we're okay. Yeah, we're okay. Thanks, buddy. As I'm on my way with this order, this no tipper is asking for extra sauce. I don't know what to tell you, customer. No extra sauce for you. All right, here we go. I'm trying to avoid another tie-up, so I'll just carry the fucking scooter up. Hmm. How can I get through here, bro? Okay, it's okay. I guess not, okay. How you doing, buddy? Oh, man, you got bike, man. Thank you. I'll leave the bike right here. This person is just blowing me up with fucking text. Hey there. Chick-fil-A. Yeah, you enjoy, so of course. I'd be careful with the drinks, okay? Appreciate you. Of course, enjoy. Thank you. Get back to Chick-fil-A and got a $5.50 point for McDonald's. Let's do it. A lot of traffic out here, but we're zipping through everything as usual. I feel like I'm going to get on the sidewalk here. Look out, zombies! For DoorDash. Come on, right? Thank you. Hi, right, team. Another big one. Let's go. One of our regular spots over on Yucca. Let's go. Left on McCadden, right? Yeah. Hi, it's your DoorDash. I'm here. Thank you very much. Yeah, enjoy. Right as we dropped that off, we got another shitty $3, uh, I call them acceptance orders at this point, for like a half a mile to a fucking motel. I can't believe it when tourists don't tip. That's the worst. You know, those are those are low lives. All right, let's go back to McDonald's. I think that's it, no? A couple of, couple of smoothies, maybe? Beautiful. Thank you very much. See you next time. Thank you. All right, you guys, a couple of smoothies to some cheapies. This looks like a, like a not disgusting hotel, but it's a shitty fucking hotel for sure. I can't leave the scooter out in this part of town, so I'm just carrying it up here. Fuck it. Is one thirteen? Is one thirteen down here? Right. Thank you. Oh, a nice little thank you from the customer. Down the stairs. Watch your back, bro. I don't want to hit you here. Thank you. All right, guys, back to some sort of center. We did it. Four dollar fifty cent point six mile panda. Let's go. All right, see you next time. All right, this should be an easy order. The guy's gonna meet us out front. He says, "Let's hey, are you my Panda Express? Awesome. How you doing, buddy? Pretty good. Pretty good." Hi, right, bro. Enjoy. Thank you. So Take it easy, man. $4.50 order there with a $1.50 tip. I mean, it's rare that a valet doesn't tip. I mean, come on, man. Come on. If you're a valet guy, you got Pretty it. Pretty good. $7.7 7 mile Chick-fil-A. Taking that. Hey there for Amani. Right. Did have a drink? Of course. Thank you. See you next time, guys. All right, team. We got it. We're going to the Camden. Usually a pretty easy place to drop off at. The Camden, very nice security, always watches the vehicle for me. It's never a problem here. Do I want to do a 12-item order for Mother's Market? No. 
2.3 mile, $12.62 order from Sephora. We're doing that. It's gonna take us far east, but we got plenty of range. Just like yesterday, there's something wrong with the app. I definitely accepted that order and it just vanished off my fucking queue. So, so much for that Sephora order. I didn't wanna drive that far anyhow. This is gonna take us close to home. $8.50, one mile double from Boba Time and Love to Eat Thai. Let's go. All right, we got the we got the boba. Now we just gotta go next door to Love to Eat Thai. Your destination will be on the right. Team, we got this order from Love to Eat Thai. Let's pack it up and get the hell out of here. Probably our last one. This first one is to a regular spot up on Whitley. This is us right up here. We usually just leave the scooter right at the door. It's a pretty simple drop off spot. Man, look at all these fucking cars. DoorDash, Celia. Yes, sir. Thank you. <laughs> Alrighty, thank you. You too. Now we're going to some hotel over on Highland. And I just got noticed that this laptop that I ordered so I can stream better just arrived. So I really want to get home. I don't want them to sit in front of my door. It'll, it'll end up getting fucking stolen. All right, guys, let's go. We passed it. We're just looking for a place to turn around. <laughs> I'm going to tell it in the live stream, but I rear ended somebody on my RS, no, on my Dultron Thunder uh, coming home from the valley the other day. I haven't really talked about it at all. I'm just gonna talk about it in the live stream. Maybe I, I already did by the time you're seeing this, but all right, 2005, the Hilton. Hi, this is for 622. I know we don't go in here, right? No, that's okay. Fellow pioneers, this was basically, oh my God, do they want then they're texting me to bring it upstairs? Fuck. I need to tie up my bike first, but I'll bring it to you. This is such absolute fucking bullshit after I close the order to bring it to them. I don't want to get a bad rating. I fucking hate doing work after I close the order out. Such nonsense. Let's wait at 22, this, uh, this way, this way. Alrighty guys, three and a half hours, 13 and a half miles. We did 60 bucks. I'm calling it early again because I want to go home. There's a laptop in front of my door. That's sort of pricey. I don't want to leave there. How the fuck do I get out of here? Look how I left the scooter. I was so fucking mad. I just came in and dumped it on the floor. Alrighty guys, like, subscribe, comment. I appreciate your support. I'll see you next time. Thanks guys. The box is bigger than I thought it would be. There's our...